All right, ladies and gentlemen, so as you may or may not know, the Panda Soldat boss in Origins is a pretty tough boss, and a lot of people have been asking me, okay, well, how do you kill him fast? What's the best strategy, man? I, I, I can't go for high rounds in Origins because this little bastard is always following me around every three rounds with his three other friends, which is a pain. There's three pens that come every three rounds, so I'm going to give you guys some tips on how to actually kill this uh, Panda Soldat as fast as possible. Guys, so there's three weapons that can kill him really fast. I'm gonna go through those three weapons in a second, but without further ado, guys, I'm gonna let's see if we can go ahead and hit 50 likes, dude. So, if you guys watching right now, okay, I know you're gonna be like, oh, just ignore this like goal, but guys, I want everyone watching right now to go ahead, smash the like button, and then I'll give you guys something special, man. Just you guys wait and see, okay? But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's keep on continuing to the video and let's go. Alright dudes, so there is three guns right here that we are looking forward to, and uh, these guns, my friends, are the, are, the, are the most OP guns in Zombies. These guns will will, will absolutely smash the Panzers until like round 100, man. So, well, the, the first two guns I'm going to have is going to be the, the ones that really you don't really want to use and the last one is the most efficient and the best one to use so the first one i have on the list is the fire stuff dude the fire stuff is an absolutely crazy crazy gun to use against the panzer and it does really absolutely smash him but the thing is with the fire stuff is if you go for high rounds you are not able to carry two stuffs at once so the fire stuff can be a bit of a pain and really you're not going to want to use it if you're going for high rounds uh but there are some other strategies that we're using so the other gun i got on the list is if you can't get uh, any other gun out of the box and you just want to go ahead and get yourself a Mauser. So the Mauser is amazing pack-a-punch. It is a starting pistol in Origins. If you go ahead pack-a-punch that, this will absolutely shred the pans until up about round 50 I've found and after then it starts to drag away a little bit uh, but the Mauser is absolutely crazy against Panzers, dude and you can just spam it and he will get killed in no time man. So the Mauser once again you can also double pack-a-punch it, get blast furnace to help you out even more and that would also really help out a lot as well. The last gun we have here, dudes, is by far the absolutely best gun to get to kill the Papa Panzer, dudes. So this gun, my friends, is the Ray Gun Mark II, as you guys may or may not have guessed. But this gun, my dudes, is absolutely insane. I can't even, like, tell you how insane this is, man. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy, dudes. But... This gun, it's quite hard to get out of the box, but once you get out of the box, dude, you will absolutely go crazy. Non-pack-a-punched, it's still a beast, but pack-a-punched, it is hyper, man. It is hyper insanity, man. So, basically, if you guys, as you can see in the gameplay, the right Megan Ruck 2 is absolutely crazy. It wrecks them so much. The, even the Raygun Mark 1 is okay, but it's nothing compared to the Mark 2. I was on round 89, and I died on round 89, but I got up to that round just by using the Mark 2 against the Panzers, and it is absolutely crazy. I don't think, like, you can get to round 100 and still have no problems with the Panzers, dudes. It absolutely wrecks them. On the rounds that I'm on in this gameplay, literally it takes two bursts and then they're dead. It's absolutely crazy. If you get hooked, there's no problem, man, because you can just get them off you by shooting one burst of that Mark II. And, guys, this is by far the best gun to use. You're going to want to get this gun if you're going for high rounds, or you guys, unless you are a pro, you're not going to survive high rounds, man. Because these Panzers, they will take you down. There's three that come every three rounds, as I said, dude. And these things are deadly. They're not to be messed around with, dudes. But anyway, that will end up my video, my friends. These are the three best guns that you can get to do and kill the pandas and another tip for you guys if you are actually going for high rounds is you want to have either g strikes or monkey bombs so what will happen with these is sometimes the zombies get in your way while you're trying to kill the pandas but the strategy is every three rounds when you know the pandas coming you're going to want to make sure that you throw either a g strike or a monkey bomb at the start of the round so it gives you time to kill the pandas without having to worry about the zombies all over you as well but that's just another little tip there but anyway guys let's see if we can smash 50 likes on this video i know you guys can and let's see if we can do that man that'd be absolutely crazy dudes and anyway ladies and gentlemen that will end up the video if you did enjoy Make sure you do like, subscribe, turn on that notification bell. But without further ado, guys, I'll see you in the next video and peace out.